Hey there all craft beer lovers, time for that beer review once again. So the trip goes to the US of A tonight, we are returning to, there we go, there's the logo, Connecticut Valley Brewing Company out of the South of Windsor in Connecticut. And we are taking, look at this fella, Plum Crazy Sour. It's a uh, ale with plums coming in at 5.5%. In a 473ml uh, can, or a pint can, rather. So one pint can there of a uh, plum ale, sour ale at that. And there's the logo. With those lovely looking plums. There's the logo of the brewery, Connecticut Valley Brewing Company. Now that sounds good. Let's get that can cracked open, see what we get. There we go, some smoke on the can opening there. So a plum ale, a plum crazy ale, a plum sour crazy ale. There we go. Right, let's stop right there for a second or two. Right, doesn't that look nice? I think it does. One finger's worth of a nice off-white co colored head, small bubbles on top, Lovely red and pink, kind of, well, more red, so more so red colored beverage. There we go, lovely hazy, lovely hazy look, lovely color. Let's get the aroma on this one. Oh, it smells absolutely fantastic. Yeah, very fruity, tart fruity. Oh, it smells very refreshing on the nose. It's... I don't know if it's plums, but it's very fruity. Dark fruit on the nose, that's what I'm getting. A little bit of a lovely acidity on the smell. Refreshing smell. Yeah, smells absolutely fantastic. With that said, let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Mm. Yeah, that's nice. That's really, really refreshing. Really refreshing. Let's go for a quick second sip before we start to dissect it. Yeah. So, here's the deal. It's a very, very nice, easy drinking, easy going, super refreshing sour ale. Now, there's definitely a tartness to it. Got a little bit of dark fruits in there. Got a lovely, easy going beverage. Good carbonation, pushing the flavors around. Fruity overall. But it's not uh, mouth puckering at all. It's not that type of sour. So if you're expecting kind of a super acidic uh, sour, this ain't it. It's a very nice one. I'm gonna get everything in there. It's a very nice one, it's definitely tart, it's fruity, slightly acidic, but it's not much. So, lovely, good, refreshing uh, sour ale, with the emphasis more on the drinkability side of things, I would say. So it's not so much the emphasis on the acidity and the, and the, or any massive sourness there, but it's more uh, slightly acidic, uh, Refreshing, lovely, fruity, sour. Uh, for me, very refreshing, very easy going, easy drinking. More, uh, I would say this is more of a uh, kind of a uh, for someone who wants to dip their toes into the uh, sour ale uh, waters. Basically, uh, if you want to start out with drinking uh, kettle sours, sour ales. Uh, this is a good introductory uh, beer to start out with. For me, super nice and drinkable. I'm going to give it a 3.75 out of 5. Thanks for watching.